The international community says the tide is turning on at least one front in Afghanistan, the drug trade. Just every single indicator, physical indicator is positive. Opium poppy cultivation exploded across fields and farms in Afghanistan after the U.S. overthrew the Taliban back in 2001. Since then, the drug trade has been thriving, and at one point, Afghanistan provided 90 percent of the world's opium. That is, until recently. Uh, a significant decline in the cultivation, 22 percent, in production, 10 percent, in prices, in revenue accruing to farmers. It's the second straight year there's been a decline here, and local officials promise the situation is now under control. The stats from the U.N. are a bit of a relief for a country besieged by an uptick in violence. 23 more people were killed in a suicide bombing in Kabul Wednesday, including the nation's spy chief. Officials hope tackling the drug trade will help on the battlefield, as drug money is said to be fueling the insurgency. It has an impact and it does uh, influence uh, the capability of the insurgents to get that readily available cash uh, to hire uh, you know, the $10 a day Taliban. So it does have effects. However, he also uh, says insurgents remain well armed and it will take time to see this have an impact in the field. Sagar Megani, The Associated Press, The Pentagon.